recording. And we're out action. Are yeah. Good? Okay. Nicole, you're right, little server. Here is the story, and I'll start at the very beginning, which is my mom's been a teacher for a very long time, i.e., since before I was born. And she gets off work at four and it takes thirty minutes to get home, so I'm used to taking a shit every day at four thirty, <laughs> and have been for my entire life until like the last few years. Um, and this was it was four thirty every day until ninth grade. When ninth grade, I started playing basketball. Yeah, Michael Jordan. I look like him. Um, <laughs> and hurry up, Justin. You're killing me. All right. Anyways, so I'm just taking this shit at 4:30. Well, That's we were in, we were in basketball practice from three to six. So 4:30 is right in the middle of that. Now, my coach was big and scary and taught like Yoda on steroids. And I would be like, Coach, I need to go back to me. Like, hurry the fuck up, little shit. And, and seriously, that's what he sounded like. He's about eight foot tall, and he's played pro league in Austria. And he's serious. And if I took too long taking my shit, he would make me run. So I would have to just go like, oh, no, and, just, and rip that son of a bitch out of there. You know, just squeeze it right on out. And what happened is I blew an O-ring. I.e. I.e. I got a hemorrhoid. away. <laughs> Preparation H definitely does feel a lot better on and, the whole. And, what, and so one day, I'm sitting, I didn't know I had it anymore, but I'm sitting there one day and it hurt. I mean, it, it hurt. And I go, Mom, my ass itches and hurts. And she goes, Well, you may have a hemorrhoid. And then she said, But, um, and my mom's a very intelligent uh, reading teacher. Um, medical a genius. A lot of medical stuff. And she said, Go wash it. Wash it. <laughs> go wash it. Wash it. Um, and apparently, I guess she thought I had a dingleberry. I don't know. <laughs> Hold on, time out. We need to clarify this for the parents. A dingleberry is when you take your shit and have a piece of shit hanging on your ass hair. <laughs> Good. Um, this is what mom thought I should do. Well, I go to the bathroom embarrassed because I'm like, what if I do have a dingleberry? You know? <laughs> it's, it's an issue, you know? But I go in there and there's two things I'm not going to do. I'm not going to use a white washcloth because there is a dingleberry, then there's no proof of it, you know? And I'm like a Using dirty black washcloths. Yeah. And I'm not gonna use a clean one just because I'm wiping my ass, you know. So, <laughs> so I go in there and God has magically placed upon the He said sink, magically? Magically. Right. Placed upon the sink a red washcloth that is wet with bubbles on it, which means it's used, it's already got soap on it, I don't have to do anything. Else. I just go in, I mean it's just like it's just everything is lying out lying out there, okay? I go in there, I drop trowel. Um, down to my ankles. <laughs> and, and, Hawaii, and Hawaii, you know, you're, when you're standing up, you have to do a little half squat. You know? Oh, I know. So I take the red wash off and I go back and I, and I do this a little, you know, and, and, and just gracefully, just, just like, you know, you know I, just, I just make one swipe and I look to see if there is any type of mess on it and it's clean. And about the time I decide, well, why does it hurt? My ass catches on fire, <laughs> and I scream like I'm being murdered. And I scream, I scream loud and scary enough that my mom runs to the bathroom and my sister, and I'm holding the red washcloth, and my sister starts rolling the floor. And my mom starts laughing. Why? Because about two minutes ago, my sister was in there cleaning her fingernails with finger wash it. and so I have put uh, roughly some. On my <laughs> to this day. Still down right in. Huh? Yes. No, no, I'm standing there going, <laughs> holding it with the left hand. I'm like this, and I'm screaming at my you know, Leaning over the bed I'm, I'm winning on it. It's awful. It's a bad situation. To this day, his ass hairs are still bleached blonde. <laughs> I've got white hair. He frosted his ass hair tips. <laughs> Next nice story. Thank you. Well, that's a kinder coup of a time, ladies and gentlemen.